Vegas is a great city for exhibitions and auctions. With an auction, people can come to Vegas and actually win. Everybody loves a good auction, especially a celebrity auction. We've done auctions for Madonna, for Cher, for Barbara Streisand, for the Osbournes. We're the premier entertainment auction house to the stars. 1100, 1200. And about twice a year we do mixed consigner auctions. We are getting ready for our biggest sale of 2010. This is a four-day event taking place in Las Vegas at Planet Hollywood Resort and Casino. We're standing beside Planet Hollywood here in Las Vegas. Planet Hollywood is such a great partner to us. This is a perfect location for our auctions. It's a Hollywood theme auction. It's a multi-consigner sale. We have Hollywood memorabilia, music memorabilia, a day dedicated to Star Trek, everything you can imagine. All the memorabilia that we have, we expect to do very well. We have big names like Marilyn Monroe, Elvis, Michael Jackson, a lot of attention's going to that. We have his handmade Italian furniture that he ordered before he passed that's going to be auctioned off. Another piece in our music portion of the sale is this Johnny Cash guitar. Being signed by Johnny Cash and played by him greatly increases the value. The Jimi Hendrix guitar he actually purchased just two months before he died. Uh, he used it in his studio and he used it in New York and we expect that there's gonna be a lot of interest in the Jimi Hendrix guitar. This lot is one of, one of our more obscure pieces in the summer sale. It is Elvis's hair. It was given to us by a lady who won it entering a contest through the radio. On this item is fifty dollars to $70,000. Here we have some wardrobe that we're gonna be selling in the upcoming auction. This actually uh, was worn by R. Kelly, and this is actually the first lot in the sale, so hoping it'll set it off well. One of our more featured uh, ladies in the sale is Cher, and from her we have jewelry, we have Bob Mackie design sketches, Bob Mackie design dresses, more clothing that she had, a lot of furniture from her houses. We have some uh, furniture here from Anna Nicole Smith. A whole section of the auction is dedicated to her. Right next to me right here, I have uh, Anna Nicole Smith's uh, motorcycle, which is going up for auction. This is Anna Nicole Smith's car, one of our better pieces. Along with this, we have various other cars. We have the Tupac Hummer. This is famous because this was one of his last cars he was seen driving in before he was shot. Um, in Las Vegas. We also have uh, William Shatner's Harley Davidson right here. Now he's actually gonna be up in Las Vegas doing a book signing, so this is your chance to see him if you haven't. We also have uh, some uh, furniture from the estate of Gene Roddenberry, the creator of Star Trek. Gene Roddenberry has a large portion of his estate in this upcoming sale. Here's uh, Gene Roddenberry's original IBM computer. Gene Roddenberry was a very futuristic person, so very fitting, an item that could go very high at auction. Now, no matter who you are, there's something for you at Julian Summer Sale, whether you're into the old Hollywood stars or the new hopping music bands. And if you're looking to come and check out all the items in the Julian Summer Sale, they're gonna be all on public exhibition at a Planet Hollywood Resort and Casino starting June 14th, 2010. We'll have the whole mezzanine level. We'll be uh, displaying over 1,600 items that we're going to be auctioning off the weekend of June 24th. We're all looking forward to it. Hope to see you there. If somebody wants to get involved, you can, in your room, log on to juliansauctions.com. You can go down and see the items in person. The exhibition and auction are free to the public. And if you want to bid on something, you can leave a proxy bid. Viva Las Vegas, Planet Hollywood. It's going to be a fantastic auction. We'll see you there.